In this problem, we have to graph this equation in a rectangular coordinate system. So the trick is, whenever you see an equation like this, y equal to some number, it's always going to be a horizontal line, no matter what. So if it's y equals a number, it's just a horizontal uh, line. So let's go ahead and do the graph. So here's the y-axis, and here's the x-axis. So this is x, and this is y. And so all we do is we go down to negative 2, boom, boom, and then you just draw your horizontal line right here. So there it is, right there, y equals negative 2. Right, and that's negative 2. That's it. So whenever it's y equal to a number, it's always a horizontal line. If you're wondering why, think about it like this. What's x? Well, it's not here, right? So if x is 0, y is negative 2. If x is 1, y is negative 2. If x is 20, y is negative 2. If x is negative 1, y is negative 2. No matter what x is, y is always equal to negative 2. So you're going to get infinitely many points uh, where the y coordinate is negative 2. So you'll end up getting a horizontal line, which we call y equals negative 2. I hope this video has been helpful to someone out there in the world. Good luck.